Hi, I'm Christina from Spada Home Vienna and today I will be showing you a very big four bedroom apartment in Vienna's 16th district. So the apartment is very close to the Otakring U3 subway line, about 10 minute walk and then from there you're about a 15 minute subway ride to the, to the city center. So the apartment is well connected, you also have supermarkets and pharmacies around, so you have all you need right around the corner. Now let me show you the apartment. This is a big hallway when you arrive. Over there on your left is the main entrance. So as you walk in, you will have over here on your left the bedroom, one bedroom, the first bedroom. Right in front of you is the kitchen. Over here is the toilet. The next door is the bathroom with a shower and a bathtub. Following door is the second bedroom, then a third bedroom, and over here is the fourth bedroom. And this hallway also serves as a living room area with a small TV over here. So let's begin with the first bedroom right over here. It's a bigger bedroom with three beds, big window that covers the whole wall. You have a closet and a chest of drawers as well as a desk right over there. So you have two single beds and this bigger size bed, it's a double bed. This window, these windows overlook a street, a smaller street. So it's fairly quiet. It's not too, too noisy, not a big street. Let's make our way now over to the second bedroom, which is down the hall. The other three bedrooms are one, one right next to the other. This is bedroom number two, smaller bedroom with a double bed right there, a desk, big chair over here, and a closet, a standalone closet. This window overlooks a courtyard type from the building, as you can see. So this is even more quiet than the other one since it doesn't go towards the street. You have a TV as well in this room and this chair right there. The following bedroom is right next door. It's a longer bedroom with a single bed right there as you can see. Then you have also a desk and a closet. All the rooms have their heating units, the radiators, and this window overlooks that same courtyard I just showed you. This bedroom also has a small TV right there, flat screen TV. Making our way now to the fourth and last bedroom. This is very similar to the previous one with a single bed, a desk and the closet at the end there. The window overlooking the courtyard and a TV, another flat screen TV. So all the bedrooms actually have their own TVs as well as this hallway living room area. This over here is a small storage closet for cleaning products and the sort. Making our way now towards the bathroom, the shower area. It's a very big bathroom with nice brown tiles, well kept, you can tell, and nice beige tiles on the, on the walls. It's a very nice combination. You have a big bathtub and a shower, nice big sink as well, your mirror, and a little shelving unit to put your towels and such. Right next door is the toilet. It's very common in Vienna to have those two separate. So this is the toilet right there with a little sink which is a plus. Sometimes these separate toilets don't have sink, but this one does, so that is definitely a plus. And finally, making our way into the kitchen. It's a nice big kitchen, very bright. You have a window over there that overlooks that same street as the first bedroom. A little table, probably to eat in the morning or just have your meals if you have any guests over. You have a nice big fridge equipped kitchen with your oven, elements, microwave, tea machine, and a dishwasher. 
and then tons of cupboard space with pots, pans, cutlery. Over here, more cupboard space, tons of cupboard space. So that will be covered over here. There's even more. Your spices and everything. And we open up the fridge. It's a nice big fridge, which is very uncommon in Vienna. Usually they're smaller, so that's a nice plus for this apartment. And your freezer, which is also very big. That's nice. So this was a very, very nice big four bedroom apartment in Vienna 16 district. Very spacious, lots of room, lots of beds, and very well connected. See you next time.